Hey guys, welcome back to another part of the Sims 4 Cult Baby Challenge. So today is episode 14. So again, I know I should be filming other videos and doing other videos and posting other videos, but I woke up this morning and I was like, what do I want to film? Oh yeah, let me take a guess. This series, I can't stop playing it. I'm so addicted to it. Even when I'm not filming this series, I'm either editing the videos or I'm making over the Sims or building the house. Speaking of which, I have done some improvements since the last episode. A lot of improvements actually. In fact, the house actually looks semi-decent now. Not to flex everybody, but we actually have a home that actually looks okay. To be fair, I don't think it was looking but I did have a comment like every episode saying just please expand the house and I'll be like listen I didn't think it was that bad but apparently it was so I have indeed expanded the house in between episodes and I've also given a makeover obviously to Tinker because I did say I was going to do that as well give her the rest of the outfits so yeah I'm sorry if I keep posting this series but I know that you guys are really enjoying it and like I said I'm really enjoying it I don't know I just don't want to film anything else right now like there's just nothing else I want to film like this is just like <laughs> You know what I mean? You know, it's not my fault. It all, it kind of is, but it's fine. Okay, so as I just mentioned, I did indeed give a makeover to the house. So, are you guys ready for the grand review? It's not that grand. It's not that insane. But I'm going to show you guys in a very dramatic way anyways. Because you know what? I'm I'm, here all, I'm all for the dramatics. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm basically a theatre kid who didn't do theatre because I was too anxious. So, I'm not a theatre kid. But I was, you know, I, I could have been if I wasn't me. So, I guess I really couldn't. The point being, um, <laughs> ready for the reveal. ba 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 I am very happy with the expansion to the house. Obviously, the bits that have expanded are these bits on the side. So this is what I wanted the house to look like more in the very end anyways. So I just did that. So we had about 5,000 simoleons saved up, but then I also went ahead and did like the classic rummaging for decorations and also opening presents, not opening the cow plant, <laughs> opening presents, which are behind the cow plant, just to get some extra money because I kept running out, okay? I used so much debug on this house. Again, like all of the stuff is basically debug, like all of the columns, all of the landscaping, basically everything in the house is debug, but I'm really 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 happy that turned out so this is how it looks from this side and then from the side we have this little expansion and then from the back i think it's very beautiful from the back oh spoilers 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 i'll get into it in a second but i think that it turned out really cool and i'm really happy with how it looks from the outside so let's give you a tour on the inside sorry if this makes you feel sick by the way so you go in obviously and you enter the house you're like knock knock fair not who's there we're not doing a joke fair that's a whole different thing okay fair i'm sorry i don't know why i just yeah, anyways, go in and immediately you're greeted with a massive staircase. Oh, there's a light there. How is that floating? I don't know. I didn't realize that was there. Guys, there's gonna be a few little little hiccups, okay? Not a hiccup from how Stray Dragon just dotted around the house. That's not different. The point being, it's gonna have a few quirks because I, as I've mentioned a thousand times, I'm not a builder. But I'm really happy with it. So we'll start off this side. So this bit is kind of like, I didn't know what to do with it. This originally was where the fireplace was and the living room. But I decided to change it into kind of a hobby area, I guess you could say, for the kids. So this is like a, a games table board game table. I thought that'd be really nice for them. Oh, there's a crack somehow through the door. Again, listen, don't even. Then we have this little section. Again, this is all debug stuff that I've added in. Again, more debug. Obviously, there's no like curtains or anything because we don't have any of that because we're out of the money. I have like 200 smolies left, but I thought this was really nice in here. And then obviously, Jacob can do stuff down here because I originally put that in their room. But then I was like, that's kind of like a nice thing for them to do with their family. And like, I feel like it's nice for them to be involved. I'll get to the outside in a minute. But when you go through this door now, where this used to be just the end of the, the whole house used to end here. But instead, you go through here and this is now a Faya's room so it's very empty I'm not gonna lie I didn't spend much money on her room because I kind of ran out on the kids rooms but this is her new room so I think that it's really really cute I like it I like the fairy lights again most of this is all debug all of these plants everything like that all debug which I didn't realize honestly I spent like hours genuinely and hours and hours going through after I finished the last episode and making this house over and I spent hours digging through debug every single pack that I have I clicked on the debug and looked through it and went through every single item like I was there forever I had so much fun doing it so she has a little recording bit obviously you know this is all very bare and stuff but trust me, it'll get better. And then we go over this way. Here is the bathroom. So this is how it looks. Oh, hello, Jay. Are we about to watch you poo? Oh, no, you've just pooed. Okay. A bit smelly, Jacob. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Your bowel movements are fine. But <laughs> this is the bathroom. So it's basically the same as before, but expanded a little bit. And I added this window because I thought that was very pretty. And then, oh, this is under the stairs. Oh my God, Harry Pottery. Yeah, just kidding. Okay. Then, oh, I forgot to mention there's like a few little decorations by the door. Then you go over here and the kitchen is the same. Pretty much I added some like pots and pans on there and stuff like that. Just to give a bit more decoration, a little coffee mug and stuff. But other than that, there's not really much of a difference here. I did try and change it, but it didn't really work out. And I thought this looked really cute over here. Then we have this little bit which i just again more debug stuff i just thought that looked kind of cute and then through to my favorite part of the house which is this bit here so this whole room is my favorite so you got this dining room which is so lovely with these glass windows i kind of imagine that the whole house is very old but then she's kind of done this this is like an extension it's the house that she's added on or like she changed the windows and i think this is so beautiful and the idea of sat here having like christmas dinner and like looking out there i know that they don't even do that okay listen it's the sims 4 okay and also daddy winter's gonna be dead in a minute like he's literally in the pool over there you know what i'm saying but you know if you if you take away all that um <laughs> it should be fine and then 
then you go around here. You've got some plants over here. And then my absolute favorite part of the entire house. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I love this living room so much. So it's basically the same house that wasn't there. Except I did add a lot of debug stuff. And also this mirror, which I think is stunning. Oh my god, I'm a vampire. Oh my god. Sorry. <sighs> I'm so lame. Anyways, I think that this is so beautiful. Everything about it is just stunning. Like, the whole vibes in here. I added this again all from Debug. I just think it's beautiful. I know this is a fire hazard. Listen. Okay, if it burns down, it's not my problem. But I do obviously need to add more stuff to it, but I just think this bit is so beautiful. So, that is pretty much everything for downstairs. Then when you go upstairs, oh, is Amethyst going upstairs? No. No, she's not. Okay, never mind, Amethyst. You go upstairs, and I actually went into a different save file, and I took photos with all of the occult so far, except for QWERTY, because um I kind of got lazy, and I couldn't bother to go and get them. But, um, <laughs> I took photos in a different save. So we have like more posed ones because the other ones were just selfies. So I think these are better. So I kind of tried to get the, the vibe of the relationship onto it. So these two, they were kind of happy. You know, it was kind of chill. It was the first one. Then you moved on to the second one, which was Grace. And I feel like, you know, they got along pretty well as well. You know, they're very chill. Then we have Daddy Winter, who obviously she's asking for a present from him. Uh, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, sorry. <laughs> then we have this tragic clown who obviously is looking very sad. And then finally we have Caleb and her, which I think they got on really well. So I put a nice photo there. And I figured this could be a whole wall of photos with the occult parents. And I think that's really cute. So I did that. Ignore this trim. By the way, it's the roof trim. And I am an idiot who can't build. So I can't get rid of that. But anyways, then you go along here and we'll start on this side. So this is Jacob's new room. So everyone now has their own room. So I'll show you guys around. But this is Jacob's room. I kind of tried to go for the werewolf thing, but obviously they're not like fully aware. Werewolf. So I kind of tried to go for werewolf, but also not like fully werewolf, you know what I mean? Because they're a bit more polished than that. I think this is really cute. Again, all this stuff's from Debug. I just thought like this kind of decoration is like my style. So I just thought it was really fun adding that stuff in. Then we obviously got their photos from prom. Still think that one's so adorable. There's not really much going on here because again, I did run out of money, but I think this wall's really cute with their little gym stuff. And then come through here and then this is Amethyst's new room. So I really love this one because I love the purple and also she has this like glowing ball there and all these plants because I imagine her to be really into plants. She has like this owl on the wall. She has the fairy lights going across her. She's got her axe a lot on the side there as well and she's also got all of her photos on the wall there as well from prom and i just really love how this looks i just think it looks so cool and witchy and then through here is another bag. oh hello thank you for opening the door for me dear eve oh you broke the sink no wonder you're walking out looking like you've done something wrong you have done something wrong eve okay this is another bathroom in here unfortunately still no shower in here but we'll get one at some point also very open imagine going on your casual hike and you just see like i don't know a flipping vampire in there showering or something that would be kind of scary although if it's caleb at all you know <laughs> sorry anyways then you go over here yeah, and we have this room, which is Renesmee. So obviously she's only a baby, but when she ages up, this will be her room. She has her own bit. Again, there's not much decoration going on here because I'm kind of run out of money. There's six rooms upstairs and then two bathrooms. And then obviously downstairs, you've got fairs. So technically there's not enough room for every single child, but I figured every time there's just gonna have to be like two that share room, which is fine because the rooms are pretty big. Then we have Eve's room through here. This is all very decorated to Christmas. Obviously as she ages up, she's gonna hate Christmas a bit, but for now, I think this is really, really cute. I added some, again, more debug stuff. Then we go down here. Yeah, and we have Tinker's room who's doing stuff right now because I did obviously give her a makeover. I'll show you guys in a minute. But I gave her this room. So she's now got her Tinker and stuff in here because I feel like whilst Jacob... Okay, okay. Uh, why is everyone in here? I don't know. Uh, Jacob? Oh my God, you nearly just whacked your... <laughs> whacked his sibling over the head with a hammer. Okay. Tinker, I know you don't like them that much, but that's a bit concerning. But I feel like this room's just really, really cool. And I, even though Jacob wanted to, like, go downstairs and, like, you know, like, be with everyone, Tinker doesn't. You know, oh my god! <laughs> this is a hazard. She needs to put, like, a sign that says, do not enter. Jesus Christ. But I thought this place was really cute. And she still has a bunk bed. But obviously she just doesn't have Amethyst under there anymore. And I added, like, really cool, like, little robotic stuff that she's probably created. And, like, the periodic table and stuff like that. I just thought it looked really cool in here. And then through here is another bathroom, which only has a bath right now. Nothing else, unfortunately. Because I didn't have any money and then finally when you go through this room we have the toddler's room so here we have penny having a poo penny poo uh -huh. Why did I just laugh at that? It wasn't even a joke. So this is Penny's section. It's not that decorated specifically to them because I imagine that this is always going to be like the toddler and infant room. I thought that this was a pretty nice room for them. They also got this. They opened the gifts outside and they managed to get that. So I was like, oh, that's perfect. We'll add that into the room. That's the little art section. And then we just had that. So yeah, that is everything. So, oh, oh my God. Faye just maxed the parenting skill. That's so good because she can take care of the babies a lot easier. Wait, that person just invited us out. Sorry, distracted, but Theo just invited us out. Theo must be a witch then because he just invited us out to the magical world. Anyway, so this this is how it looks overall. I think it's really, really cool. And then in the garden, it's a bit kind of grim right now, but we have this obviously open bit here. We also have a pixelated... Who's this? Is that Jacob? Jacob, are you taking a shower? Yes, you are, dear. You are. Again with the robotic arm, trying to copy goddamn Tinker all the time. But I thought out here was nice because I've added these like gardening bits instead and just kind of put down the best ones. And obviously Patchy's still there. And I added this little debug shed as well, but I thought that was nice. So yeah, and then this little thing over here and the little hopscotch. So yeah, I'm really happy that I turned out. Obviously I'm still expanding and like doing stuff on it every single time. Basically between episodes, I always expand on it. 
it because I just find it so much fun. And there's obviously still a lot of quirks to it that need to be changed. And we need to obviously get more money and stuff. But for now, I'm really happy with it. So yeah, sorry for a very long tour at the start. Also, you guys said in the comments to get a Cass unlocker. So I did download that just before filming. And I did manage to take off Jacob's scary things in their werewolf form, which is good. And then obviously I did give Tinker a makeover. I can show you guys how she looks afterwards because we've got to age Renesmee today because it is her birthday. So a few things are going to happen today. Obviously, Renesmee is going to age up into an infant, which I'm dreading. I'm not going to lie. Other than that, the people outside are probably going to die, which is good. Uh, <laughs> really, I just kind of want to like work on everyone really today. I kind of want to go to school with the teens just because there's three of them. It makes sense. It'll be a lot of fun like going to school with them. And I want Tinker also to, to be working on this. Oh, you're very stinky, girl. You're very, very stinky. You guys really like how Tinker looks as well, which is really good. So I'm happy about that. I love Tinker so much. I'm not going to lie. I think she's my favorite. Oh my God, Eve, what happened, girl? Oh my God she's oh my god you know what it was we went to the beach girly have a bath oh my god what is wrong with you <laughs> that's so bad oh my god Sh listen i know i said she wasn't my favorite but i don't want her to fall asleep and drown in the bath you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying different vibes the toddlers are awake honestly i don't mind having toddlers at all it's just the infants like i'm dreading when you know the child ages up you know that one that we've got uh, Renesme. When she ages up, disaster's gonna strike. But for now, we have a tiny bit of time where we just have toddlers, which is fine. Let's sell the plate. It's so much bigger in here now. It's so difficult to like find everywhere. Like it's just so weird having it such a big space. Like before, it was so teeny tiny. Well, it wasn't teeny tiny, but it was definitely a lot smaller. Like basically, it was cut off there. So these whole expansions are completely brand new. I don't know how I managed to afford it, by the way. I was scrounging up money. Honestly, it was it was it was bad. It was really bad. It was really bad. But it was fine. Oh, and Tinker also likes to have a robotic arm. I mean, you already do babes but this one's like full robotic interesting you guys have interesting choices of shower attire most people just go in the news but no they're like yeah you know what a bionic arm totes totes the vibe you know <laughs> okay i'm gonna get amethyst to do some magic let's get you practicing some practical magic because i want her to get her spells also she has talent points which i didn't realize so she has three so we can get some things forager mm, not really worth it oh research experiment and tone reading speed to greatly increase that would be good because i think we're experimenting now i don't know i'm just gonna like pick a few random ones i don't really mind what we do to be honest but also i would like her to like maybe come out here and plant this stuff just because i feel like she's very into plants as i gave her in a room but yeah i'm really happy with the house let me know what you guys think obviously like i said i'm just gonna zoom you out a little bit i felt like we were a bit intimate for a moment as i said you know it's still got a lot of work to do i don't want to just do it all in one and then it just be like immaculate from the very beginning like i like the fact that it's going slowly over time also the absolute that's it's not even green that's like black stink coming out of your bum right now jesus christ come on upstairs babes i need you to take care of your babes you know uh <laughs> oh delicio oh my god wait isn't that the one where you can like make food oh <gasps> create a tasty meal i think that would be so good because we could literally just keep doing that over and over again and then she could get loads of food interesting interesting Amphis. i knew there's a reason we had you as a child i'm just kidding there was two reasons <laughs> Oh my god, wait, Grand Delicia Roro. I kind of want to try both. Oh my god, she got pizza. What is it? Pepper. Um, personally, want to go for pepperoni, but it's fine. Did you manage to get anything? <gasps> Hot dogs. Oh my god, that's so good. You could literally just keep doing that over and over again. But I am going to get you to sleep because you're about to pass out. And I want everyone good for school tomorrow. Oh, is the cow plant okay? No, what? Girl, you don't need to go out to the cow plant. It's fine. Don't worry. I'm like, let me just quickly go to the toilet. Mm -hmm. And I'm at the toilet. <laughs> It's such a long way to go now. Like, it used to be. I remember back in my day. Back in my day, it was a little shack in the wooden middle of nowhere. What happened? You know what I mean? What happened? All of a sudden, we have a massive blinking house, don't we? Oh, crazy, crazy, crazy times, really. Can you please change the nappy? Please, the stinky child. Nothing like a good nappy to make you hate smoke. Does anyone get concerned by that? Like, who's buying? <laughs> who's buying the used nappy for hate simoleons? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to think about it, really, because it's a little bit scary slash concerning slash horrifying like what is with that you know who you know who with caleb oh i was like oh my god why is caleb here right i do now yes that has that does make sense i love the idea as well that like first of all vlad's wearing speedos i mean there's just something so amazing about that but also the fact that like literally these two don't even get on that well i don't think in my mind anyways they don't get on that well oh my god tinker gully gully what are you doing you know what you're gonna have to take care of the child i know you don't want to trust me i don't want to either okay but renesme has to be took care of by someone and unfortunately your mother is terrible like she is the worst ever so she had a eureka moment not about her kids though did she no where are you going child what was the point of this where are you putting it wow well done on art honestly well done but you guys were happy with the idea of art being the nicer one so I, I think we might go with that oh my god just take care of the flipping child flipping child please tinker 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 please oh my god she's so scarred <laughs> Girly, this is not funny. This is not a joke. This is a sick joke. Come on. Listen, I don't want to. Trust me. I would rather be doing anything else right now as well. But unfortunately, it's going to get taken away. And then we'll have to have another one. Do you want another one? No. 
Then you'll have to have another sibling. All right, have some stay awake for 24 straight hours. Jesus Christ, I'm so sorry, Tinker. I'm pretty sure that was you. Have you just glitched? <gasps> Uh-oh, the child's becoming an infant. Well, <laughs> I thought we had more time. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, yay! The child's become an infant. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Okay, Renette's my age dub. Let's go ahead and randomize the trait. Please be a good one. Please be a good one. Sensitive. Diaper rash. I mean, I guess, you know, she can't go in the heat. Maybe that's some sort of similarity. She looks... She's cute. She's cute. Okay, I will go into creative in a second. But unfortunately, I had not thought about the fact that we don't have anywhere to put her at the moment. Well, we do. We have a whole room. But I don't know, like, we kind of should probably get, like, a crib or something. Although, I didn't use a crib before. I mean, it looks more aesthetically pleasing, but at the same time it's like so much more hassle because you have to get the child out of the crib and then put it back in the crib like can you not just get a ladder you know and climb up it i mean is that dangerous yeah but you know at the end of the day life's a risk you know 300 simoleons okay i think we yeah we do have this baby mat unfortunately it's not got the color scheme we can go for a gray i mean it's not quite this dark color scheme i was going for but it'll be fine and does the child need anything else really i mean not really i mean really the child's fine with just that i mean a little plant next to it never hurt anyone you know what i'm saying maybe we just go with like a little debug yarn toy because that's quite horrifying and uh and that's really it isn't it i guess you don't really need anything else and everything else get oh an ice cream reaper mm -hmm, absolutely absolutely but i think that's really it i don't don't really see why we need anything else to be honest i think the child's fine with that there's not really anything you don't need, you don't need anything else do you no, that's it, it okay cool uh put renee's may there tinker and then you can go to bed okay i promise oh no you can't actually you gotta feed the child i'm so sorry tinker i know this is not what you want to be doing today i know it i do but unfortunately have you seen Faya? she is passed out <laughs> come on girly you can do it i believe in you i believe you've got the talent you've got the talent you've got the skills maybe you could put some like breast milk into your arm and then just like shoot out into the child you know that could be a vibe not a vibe no i guys listen it's again hot in the uk so you, you can't take anything, I say, with anything more than a pinch of salt. Even a pinch of salt seems a bit much, you know what I'm saying? Please put the child... Please put the child... Feeding Tinkler? You're joking. To be fair, Tinker, I hate to tell you this, you also were a feeding Tinkler. So I can't really... Th I don't really think that you can kind of judge the child. Go to bed. What the flip are you doing? You can't get to bed. Mmm all of this aesthetically pleasing work girly what even is that oh that's the mother isn't it from strangerville well let's hope that that is not actually anything like that please go to bed please you can't mm -hmm. i'm fine guys don't even worry about it i'm fine i'm literally complete and utterly fine thank you wow that was so much effort wasn't it oh look at her with a little outfit with the hair down i think she's really cute you guys liked her as well actually before you get to bed babes can i just go into create them real quick thank you we'll make over an esme and i'm also gonna show you guys tinker's outfit so here is tinker now so this is the outfit i'd already given her also someone said that i have forgot to give her a hearing aid she does have it it's just that when she's wearing the headphones you can't actually see it and it kind of like comes off but you can see when she's on her athletic she's got it so yeah just letting you know but this is her every day which you did see before then we have her formal which i think is really pretty her athletic her sleep her party her swimwear her hot weather and her cold weather i'm not gonna lie i don't see her ever wearing the swimwear um because you know why would she go swimming that's a bit of a danger but i think that this is a really really cute like you know with that arm i would not trust anything but i think she's really really cute and i really like how she turned out so yeah that is tinker's outfits and i also did go ahead and give everyone their sexuality so i made it so that she's our ace someone was asking what ace is it's asexual it's basically just google it uh <laughs> what asexuality is but basically yeah so I gave her that and also for Jacob as I did say I did manage to get the castle locker thank you guys for letting me know that that's a thing so I managed to make them into an actual werewolf even though they're still horrifying even without all the blood you know and the ghost in that eyeball they still scare me a little bit but anyways let's make over Renesme now so obviously Renesme is a vampire <gasps> wait she is a vampire yes oh my god i forgot to check that's so embarrassing but she is a vampire that's perfect you guys were saying oh my god you're killing off the only two vampires that you know like vlad and caleb and i was like guys first of all lilith fator exists but secondly i was really hoping that the child was a, a vampire and she is so i'm really really happy about that so that's great so we could tick that off the list as well we've gotten by the way like literally every single sim so far has been the occult which i think is really lucky i mean i know it's only really been three of them that have can actually have you know been like that but i'm really happy with it anyways so let's have a look how she looks oh my god okay so she's really cute so she's always the baby caleb fator you can kind of see that i'm not gonna lie with the the lips she has caleb's lips which is really funny let's just give her a bit of a makeover she had the ginger hair but i might go for black i don't know mm, or red mm, i don't know i might go for black just because we've only got art so far with black hair and we've got a couple of kids with ginger hair already so i feel like you know it'd be more fun to mix it up a little bit she looks really sad 
<laughs> like really, really sad. Although when do the Sims children not look sad? Let's be well, my Sims children not, not look sad. I think I'll give her some freckles now. Actually, no, I probably shouldn't give her any because it doesn't make sense. Because obviously she can't go out into the sun, so she wouldn't have freckles. Although I know you can get freckles anyways, like genetically, but because I do always give my Sim freckles, I will not. I will not. Which I say with a heavy heart. Oh my god, she just has little gums. The little two teeth are so cute. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> she looks so sad. I also love her ears. The fact that she's gotten like proper vampire ears is incredible. Again, she's been given the masculine thing. I don't know what's going on with that, but I am just gonna take that off because again, hair has no gender. What do you mean? What kind of hair screams vampire? Um, I don't really know. I don't really know. Honestly, that one's adorable. Maybe that. I think that's really, really cute. And it shows off her ears. So let's give her an outfit. I'm not really feeling this one. I can't lie to you, babes. Can't lie. Not the vibe. It's not the vibe at all. Do I have anything that screams vampire? Probably not really, but we'll go with definitely something that's like kind of creepy. <laughs> like, so like that's kind of creepy. I don't know. I kind of want to go for like red and black vibes. Okay, I'm sort of obsessed with this because she's got the little red tights, but then she's got a full black outfit, which is basically what her room looks like, which is amazing. <laughs> okay, so here she is. Here is her every day. I think this is so cute. Her formal, her sleep, party, hot weather, and cold weather. I think she's so, this outfit in particular is the most adorable thing ever. I think she's so cool and so angry looking, and I just love it. So I'm really happy with how she looks. So let's go back into game and see what she looks like. I forgot the tinker was just like mid. <laughs> Unfortunate bit. I'm so sorry, Tigger. Oh no. Okay, the kids go back to sleep. Please, 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 please. They go back to sleep. Please. Thank you. Thank you. No, they genuinely. Oh, once again, Lana, you're an idiot. Of course, we've got people dying out here. So that's not. We can't speed up through the night. Of course. Uh, let's just do a little time lapse of this again, shall we? Mm -mm -mm. Good views, you know, good sights. Imagine going sightseeing, you know, you're just like casually having a, you know, oh, look at that person. Oh, it's a child. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, it's a little bit worse when it's a child. I was going to say, imagine just like casually like having a little wonder and then all of a sudden it's just like three people dying. They're not dying yet, though. So it's not that trauma. They've just been in here for like a full day. So it's all good. <gasps> I'm feeling very unsatisfied in her relationship. If you're mean to me while I feel this way, a romantic relationship will suffer. <gasps> oh, my God. <laughs> Wolfgang. Oh, I also gave Wolfgang and Nova a bit of a makeover. Obviously, Nova's one of your guys' sims, so I didn't do, like, too much. Just, like, added some CC, but I gave him a makeover. I think he's really cool. You know what? I love Wolfgang. I feel like he's an underrated legend. You know what I'm saying? I can't believe that. That is... That, uh, <laughs> what? What do you mean? What do you mean? And Kayla. Oh, to be fair. <laughs> I, I get that a little bit. I, too, would feel unsatisfied if my kind of girlfriend was trying to kill me. You know, I would find that a little bit unsatisfying personally. You know what? Ch child, don't wake up Tinker, okay? Just because she helped you yesterday does not mean that she needs to help you again, okay? I'm on team Tinker at this point. Oh god, she's gonna be knackered and we have school today and I want to go with them. So, that's unfortunate. Come on, Amethyst. I believe you. Reperio! Does it work? Did it work? Oh, it worked! That Babes, I love you so much. My favorite child, just for the fact that she can do that, is incredible. Like, she's actually useful. You know what I'm saying? Like, listen, I know that, you know, Jacob's given, you know, art bath, blah, blah, blah. Cute times, cute times. But can you repair a sink by just saying the word repair it? No. No, you can't. Right, everyone's off to school in an hour. So I want to get everyone ready. Oh my God, come on, people. Look out. Oh my God, Tinker's going to have such a bad day. <laughs> it's the first day of school. We'll be going in with her as well. And she's literally like this bad. Okay, clearly I'm really great at, at life, truly. My bad, guys. My bad. Yeah, we have 10 minutes to watch. Watch some telly, please. Look at your foot. And oh, oh my God, I don't have energy and everything. Right, she may be tinkering a bit too much last night. Okay, this is bad. This is really... Okay, Um, let's all go to school. Yay! Good first day of teen school. Oh yeah, this is gonna be great. <laughs> Just ignore the fact that you're kind of like, you know, on your deathbed. <laughs> or one might say, in the factory, ready to be, you know, broken up into pieces because you're kind of a robot. Yay! Okay, right. I'm pausing immediately. Oh god, Jacob's feeling a bit. Okay, can I like not? do that if that's okay oh also funny story i was taking screenshots for the thumbnail and i look over and jacob is just squatting and i was like huh um that's a thing that's happening i did take a screenshot i'll put it on the screen now it really made me laugh it really did make me laugh but how do i like not become a werewolf that would be like good you know what i'm saying because like i'm not really like vibing with that life that much right now once again jacob's like not at school oh wait these two don't have the thing either it's just tinker now i don't know why this is so glitched but i'm not gonna complain you need to work out an exercise machine <laughs> have you seen tinker you know what i'm saying like she doesn't exercise she's like me maybe she should just go have a nap you know is there anywhere to nap no oh can they come in here i mean i don't see why not <laughs> it's fine it's fine 
fine. I'm sure she's really, you know, she knows the teachers well. Jacob, is there anyone around like his Wolfgang here? Oh, is he not? That's a shame. You know what, Jacob? Actually, maybe you should come down here and work out a little bit. Because apparently you're not at school today. Neither is Amethyst. It's just Tinker. I don't know why this keeps happening. But again, I won't really complain because it does work out pretty well for us. Oh my god, we can leave a note to someone asking them to prom. I do want Tinker to like meet someone. I don't think she'll go to prom with anyone though. As in like meet someone as in like make some friends. Can you not go in there? Oh my god, teachers and their ways. That's like such a lovely sofa as well. Oh, wait, there's one right out here. <laughs> okay, my bad guys, my bad. You can just sleep here, babes. Don't worry about it. Look how Amethyst is just making herself at home in the principal's office. She's not even at school anymore, so I don't know why she's going in there. Oh, okay, this seems like one of your guys' sims. How many spells has Amethyst actually got right now? Because we need to get 10 for her to age up. I'm scared she's got like a lot, you know what I mean? Okay, she's got four. Like, I wanted to obviously move out because then we can have another baby, but also at the same time, I'm kind of be sad, but I definitely think she'll be the one aging up and leaving first, which is really sad. But yeah, she's not at school today, so I guess, oh my god, bit of romance. With who? Tane? Oh my god, girl. Get a grip. I thought you've got Nova. But I also like, obviously I wanted to move out because like it's good when she moves out, but yeah. Okay, so she does go to class. She just doesn't have the option thing there. That's okay, so I guess you both need to go to class. This is very confusing. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, so everyone is going to class. This is weird. I don't know why there's no thing up here, but whatever. Also, I did give Jacob this new outfit. It's very different for them, but I thought it was really cute with the little hat. And I just, I don't know, it's very different. This walk is not really giving. Like I'm trying to like do a runway model right now. Like I'm kind of like trying to show everyone like guys, look at the new outfit and you're walking like this. Like it's not really like giving the vibe. You know what I'm saying? Also 1,300 from our things. So we need to actually do more of that, but that's okay. We want more of the videos. I love this teacher's hair, a legend. Hey, everybody in class. <gasps> Wait, they're all in the same class. That's so cute. Oh my God. And these two are like towards the back and this is the front. I feel like that kind of makes a little bit of sense because Tinker just wants to be alone. <gasps> okay, Tinker's also fallen asleep. Good start. Good start, girl. Good start. Can you take some notes or something? Like, should you not be doing that right now? No, I guess not. You just don't want to today. I mean, sure. Sure. It would have been helpful. It's fine. Don't worry about it, Tinker. You know, you're a robot. Maybe you have like a photograph memory. That's, that's, you know, it's fine. It's, that's, I'm sure that's totally what happened here. I want to guess it's one of your guys' sims because her last name is just Mermaid. Uh, so I'm assuming. I don't want to make assumptions, you know. Uh, but I'm assuming she's a mermaid. Also obsessed with the fact that Jacob's book is pink and Amethyst is blue. I mean, that's so cute. I don't know. Little things like that. It's so adorable. Come on, guys. Are you out of class yet? Yes. Tink out, honestly, girl. Just go back to bed. Just literally go. I say go back to bed. Go back to sleep on the on the very uncomfortable chair. Thank you. Amethyst, come out here and why don't you do some more practicing of your spells? Although, I guess we could get to know some more of the people, but there's not really that many people around. I'm going to get Jacob to meet them as well. Sniff and introduce. You're joking. Oh my God. You actually just sniffed her. I mean, she might smell a bit like, you know, coral and like the seawater because, you know, she's literally a fish, but take a feral poo. Go for for it. Go for it, honey bun. Oh, we're 24 hours pay up before the power shuts off. Uh-oh, how much are bills? <laughs> I didn't think that. I did not know we had bills. Did we get bills? 895. You know what? That's not that bad. I feel like it's going to be a lot more now that the house is expanded. I'm a bit concerned about that, but it should be fine. I think all of these guys are your sims, so that's fun. I wonder if any of these people are werewolves. I'm not werewolves. <laughs> if any of these people are spellcasters, because then we can probably practice with them, but I don't know who is. Also, I was going to add people to Social Bunny, because then that way you just kind of build friendship over time, which is really helpful. So I'm going to add Wolfgang. We're just going to add basically everyone, because then, like I said, once you have them on the content list, it's so easy to just get your friendship up. And also for like the family members as well, it'd be nice. Look how, can I just say, Jacob knows everyone. It's so nice. I feel like Jacob gets along with basically everyone, which is weird considering they're kind of a part-time wolf. But yeah, we're also going to add a add dead father on there. So that's a good sign. Also, Edward, because I am intrigued by that whole situation. But I really like Wolfgang. But then at the same time, like, clearly it's not going that well. Maybe we should go with someone else. We could actually find, like, another werewolf, which would be fun. I also didn't realize how close Fail was with all of her kids. I didn't realize that. I don't know why I just didn't picture them being that close. But they actually are, which is really nice. Also, if we add the sages, then hopefully we can get our friendship up. Because it's so awkward. With the sages, you have to actually know them for them to teach you stuff. And that's really annoying. So if we get to know them, like, now, then when we actually go back to the magic realm, hopefully that should be a lot better. I don't think I'll add anyone. I mean, we could. We could add, I guess Tinker could have a few people. But I, I don't know. I don't think Tinker really wants to go on social buddy. I can't see her joining it. I'm not going to lie. Maybe just to speak with her family, but that's it. And she just learned Floreal. I'm assuming that that's... Keep plants healthy and bug free. That's so good. Because Amethyst is like all into plants. This is perfect. She's getting all the best ones. I'm not going to lie. This is wonderful. And Tinker's having a nice nap. You know what? This whole... This bench matches her aesthetic. So that's always a good thing. You know. <laughs> oh, and she's studying for exams. Amethyst, you don't have to do that, girl. No one cares about the exams. Like, genuinely. <laughs> it does not matter. But you can, do, you can do that. That's fine. Come on, kids. It's your last lesson of the day. Exciting stuff. I feel like Jacob's gonna become a werewolf in the middle of class. <laughs> if it was PE though, they'd do well, but this is actually foreign language class. Although they do know a second language, which is, you know, howling. You know, what what, what language are you fluent in then, Jacob? Well, <laughs> hear me out. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> 
Honestly. And then the teacher would be like, wow. Yeah, I've never heard of that one before, actually. Well, actually, I've heard my dog do it, but that's that's about it. Uh, Tinker's actually taking notes. I feel like she would really like to learn a lot of languages. Like, she'd like to know every language. So I, I like the idea that she's taking notes for this one. I don't know what the last class was, but I feel like she's probably just too good for the last class. Also love the fact that she's younger than her siblings, but she's in the same classes with them. I know that's just because it's The Sims 4, but I like the idea that she's just smarter and she's just, like, skipped, like, 10 grades. So she's just in the same class as them. Okay, and school is over. Yay, 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 yay. Yay. Okay. <gasps> I've just realized. Oh my god, I went to school with them. Oh, guys, I'm an idiot. I'm an actual idiot. The people have come out of the pool. Oh, for God's sake. This whole pool situation is so difficult. I feel like we might have to go back to the puffer fish thing. It's almost saying, like, start a fire or something, but I don't know how easy it is to, like... <sighs> This is annoying. I completely forgot, guys. I bet you were screaming at me when I pressed yes. I bet you guys were like, no, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. There's got to be other ways. To yeah, they're out of the pool. There's got to be other ways to kill Sim, surely. I'm trying to think of different ways. Like the puffer fish. I mean, okay. Currently, Tinker's in a really bad mood. So, I have got an idea. If she eats... Or is anyone else in a bad mood? Also, Jacob is late. What do you mean switch control to Jacob? Jacob's finished school. Oh my god. It's so bugged. I don't know what's going on with that, but it's so bugged and it's so annoying. Okay, I've teleported them home. You're not still at school, you silly sausage. Uh, you're finished. Class in 17 hours. Yeah, exactly. No, just shut up. Okay, just shut up. Right, anyways, as I was going to say. Uh, <laughs> we need to think of a different way to kill Sims. This is not working out. It's just not. Also, why is the baby just... Oh my god. Okay, it's fine. Babies, come back in here, please. Please, please, clowns, please. Jacob, help. Potty train Penny. Amethyst, put Renezme there. Tinker, you are in such a bad mood. Please go pee and have some food. Maybe just go to bed, honestly. Eve, why are you going to pee yourself, girl? What are you doing? Oh my god. And she's gonna like starve? What on earth has been happening whilst I've been gone? Hasn't she been at school all day? How has this happened? Genuinely, I don't get it. You stole your sister's bloody toy, you little sod. That's not for you, Art. That's not for you. Renesme hates being held. I kind of like that idea. That's kind of funny. <laughs> I'm gonna get Faya. Oh, should I make her do this or should I make her make some jewelry? We haven't done that in a while. Maybe we'll make some jewelry. Let's make like an expensive one. Let's spend like 130. That should be okay. And then let's use maybe more expensive metal as well. Flamingium, obviously. Obviously. And let's use one of these as well. Oh, should we buy a metal? Maybe we should buy a crystal, actually. Let's just try to spend a lot. That's 554. Let's hope that she can do something with that. <laughs> okay. Also, I was going to come out here and I was going to potentially buy some seeds. So it's currently summer, but it's going to be autumn soon. So we'll get some flowers, fruits, maybe magical plants as well. We'll just get a couple of everything. Let's open this all up and see. Because I was thinking, you know, it'd be nice to be able to get money from this. So, and especially now that Amethyst will be the one doing it, it's kind of easier. Okay. Summer and spring. Summer and fall begonias. That's perfect. Those are really expensive as well. Honestly, I'm just going to plant the rest of these. Those are worth a lot of money. I'm just going to sell everything else. Demology level five. Oh, God. I feel like Jacob's about to burst. And like, Penny's right here. <laughs> Like, Jacob's literally about to become a werewolf and Penny's just, like, chilling. Oh, God, yeah, like, literally, look. Oh, God, how do I, how do I, like, calm them down? Guys, I'm a bit concerned. Can I make them howl? Will that work? Will that make it worse? Oh, God, I'm scared. Maybe I've had to make them, like, go to sleep. <laughs> Maybe this was not a good idea, actually. Maybe not. Maybe just go to sleep. Just have a little nap. It's fine. Don't even worry about it. Yes, the children, uh, you know, might die, but, you know, it's fine. I wonder if, because Jacob's in a bad mood, if they make the puffer fish, if that'll work. I know that you can also just get bad appliances and then that's normally the best way of getting the bad one. I think they can make food or are they just like too angry? Oh wait, they're actually doing it? <gasps> okay, this might be good because this might actually be bad quality so we can actually kill someone. Oh, Theo wants to come over. Tinka, oh my god, you got a friend who also happens to be a spellcaster? Okay, I mean, we're kind of like about to pass out but like that's fine. <laughs> oh, and the child's using the nappy. That's exactly what I wanted to avoid but sure. Dislikes cooking? Yes, actually, because then you'll hate what you're doing and then you'll make bad quality puffer fish. <gasps> it's bad quality! Okay, oh my god, 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 oh my god. Best day ever. Okay, oh my god, we're gonna kill some sims. This is so exciting. Okay, I'm so this is oh this is bad actually that I'm actually that excited about killing Sims. Right, let's get everyone over then. Can we still not add bloody Clement to here? To be fair, we have tried to kill him multiple times now, so I can't really blame them. But you know, still. I wish we could like keep this. Also, someone did say that you can just let it go spoiled and when the Sims eat it, it'll work. I don't know if that's true or not, but I might try that out. But let's try it, start gathering. And then also, if Eve, this is really bad. This is really bad. But can you invite your dad over? <laughs> Because he won't come if they invite him. That's really bad. I mean, genuinely. Uh, but I don't care. So I'm actually gonna get the kids to go upstairs because, well, stuff's about to go down downstairs. So I think it's for the best to maybe just stay up here. Uh, <laughs> Tinker probably doesn't care. You know, she's a robot. She does not care. But the others, yeah, probably not for the best. Probably for the best. Jacob, please go to sleep. You're stressing me out. Football team sports day starts now. You know what else is starting? Uh, -huh. uh the death. The deaths. Should we plan it as like an actual social event? Would that be kind of fun? It's like having an actual dinner party. Would that be kind of... I think that'd be kind of fun. You know, we don't do that because, you know, 
We haven't had the chance. We could plan a social event. That would be fun, you know, to kill people. You know what, girl? Please finish that afterwards. We have more important things to do. More important than thank you. And Clement's coming round. Yay. Okay. Let's be honest. This dinner party has like two people involved, but that's okay. Although, well, we have to make stuff then. Can I be bothered? No. Let's just leave it. Let's get everyone in here. Oh, this is thrilling stuff. Now, I'm going to save because Faye is not pregnant. She could die if she eats this. So, I'm just going to be careful. We're all going to sit together. Is Clement here? Clement, please come over here. Why do you always go over there? Maybe, you know, Rudolph and them can't bloody, you know, pop you any closer. But really? <laughs> Did you have to? Girl, could you not have got changed? Like, listen, look how cool Vlad looks right now. And you're just stood there. You know, wear your formal outfit. I don't think she's ever worn that. And it's like my favorite outfit ever. Oh. <gasps> She looks so hot right now. It's insane. How are we going to do this then? Because we can't get her to eat it. But we also need Clement to be part of this. Okay, if we just end the gathering. And then we add him. And then we also add these two as well. Because if I call to meal, all the kids will come and eat it. And that's not <laughs> not the plan for the day, actually. I want everyone to die at the same time. So I really want Clement to come here at the same time. Like, it's just no fun otherwise. <gasps> oh, we have a friend round. Oh my god. Okay, Tinker, maybe take your friend upstairs. <laughs> maybe don't. He's going to... Okay, that's unfortunate for him. Uh, He's going to see stuff. Oh. Oh, and our cow plant needs feeding. Uh, oh, before you go to bed. Oh, you are trying to talk to him. Wait, this is really cute. I, I can't believe that Tinker has a friend. I'm actually really impressed. I know that sounds really bad. But like, I just expected to have, like, to not talk about anyone. I love how she just asked about Woohoo. I just love the idea of her just being really blunt. Like, what is Woohoo, by the way? Like, I just don't know what it is. Everyone keeps talking about it. I just don't know what it is. No, don't try and don't. No, no, no. The child's fine. Is it? Yeah, it's fine. Vlad's in our nursery. Bit concerning. Where is everyone? Like, where is Clement? Are you not here yet? Like, what? how long does it take, good sir? You're still on your move? Really? I love the music playing. It's, like, so peaceful. I'm actually gonna put classical on. Oh, my God, and Quirty's calling. Wait, so much is happening right now. Put classical on. Quirty's calling. <gasps> You're in love with someone? Oh, my God, I'm happy for you, Quirty. <gasps> He's here. Okay, guys. Saving the game again for the 50th time because I'm really scared that Faye's gonna die. But sit down, everybody. And everybody, grab a serving. Now, don't eat it, Faye. No, 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 no. No, no, don't eat it. Don't eat it. Faya, Faya, don't eat it. Okay, good gal. Good gal. Just pretend like you're eating it. Oh my god, this puffer fish is so tasty. Don't you guys agree? Wouldn't you agree? Tell a funny story. Totally. Oh, you've struggling with those chopsticks there, are we? Ah, uh, interesting, interesting, interesting. Well, how do you feel about puffer fish that could kill you? What's your opinion on that? You know? I mean, Caleb looks really happy right now. I do feel a bit bad for killing Caleb. Some of you guys were like, don't kill him. I was like, guys, at the end of the day, it will. It's got to happen. Oh my God. And Tinker's got another person I've seen her out. Who would have thought Tinker would have been the most popular of everyone? Not me. Not me. Not Hermione. You. Also, can we come chat up here and then go to bed? I love the idea of Tinker not knowing as well about like the idea of just like inviting someone up and just going to sleep. Like she's just like, night. And then he's just stood there like, night. Uh, <laughs> I kind of love that. People are starting to eat it a bit more. Come on, guys. Why are you going to play with the bloody cow plant? To be fair, I feel like she would be really into the cow plant. Like, I feel like they'd be good friends. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, I'm so scared. I'm gonna save again. For like the 50th time. Okay, I'm just scared. I just feel like face. am I gonna die? <gasps> Jake's really very uncomfortable. So is Vladdy Daddy. I can't tell if that's just because they're not meant to eat food because they're vampires or not, but come on. You know you want to. You know you want to die. <gasps> Caleb's at it fully. Is he gonna die? 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 Wait, Vlad, what are you doing? Vlad, get back. I feel like Vlad's impossible to kill. I feel like we're never gonna kill him. <gasps> okay, Clement's at it. He's at the food. Is no one gonna die? Are you kidding me? He's taking out the trash. I mean, good for you, but are you not gonna... Really? <laughs> it's poor quality. I know that apparently Daddy Winter can't die, but like, surely. Are you joking? They're just not gonna die? All of that? They're not actually dying? Are you kidding me right now? Why have we picked the only immortal occults? Like, we got so unlucky with that. Are you kidding me right now? I don't wanna put that in the fridge though, because people are gonna eat it. I don't want people to eat it. Maybe if we just put it in her inventory. Oh, I don't know. We'll just put it in her inventory. I can't believe this. Are they actually not gonna die? Like, really? Dead serious. You're gonna flirt with Caleb right now. What are you doing? Just cause for your commitment. Well, yeah, commitment to die. I can't believe that. I actually can't believe that. I was so committed. I was so, I was so under the impression that they were definitely gonna die. Okay, we're just not good at killing people anymore. Back in the day, it was so much easier. Okay, I guess the pool again. But I feel like they're just not ever gonna die. I know that either Daddy Winter or Caleb are really not good in the sun. So I think I might put them both out. Like if we just come over here, I'm just gonna put them outside of the sun. And I know one of them will probably die because I don't think they're both sun resistant. So if you go there, babes. Oh, and Daddy Winter's there. You know what? We could trap you all in there. That's fine. Don't think they should be able to get out of there. Although, Vladdy Daddy can teleport. So, I think he might just teleport away. But he just walked through the fence. You're joking. What do you mean? Surely you can't walk through the fence again. Thank you. No. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna cry if that would have happened. This is so difficult. Oh my god. I was so happy with Jacob as well. Oh, and also Jacob's literally about to become a werewolf. I don't know how to stop. I, I just don't know. I think that they're just gonna become a werewolf now. <sighs> well. 
<laughs> the last few days have just not been our days. You know, they just haven't. It's just not been great, really. I should really get going now. Can you actually go, though? Okay. Vlad Daddy did leave, but Kayla can't. That's good. I'm just going for a distant phase. Oh, my God. <laughs> Why is every episode of this getting so much more disastrous than the last? It's actually impressive at this point. At least we have a cute house now. I guess that's a good thing. They keep saying I should really get going now. And then Faye is like, really? Should you get going now? Interesting. Seems like you can't though, doesn't it? <laughs> Just seems like that's kind of impossible, actually. Um, Interesting enough. Jacob is now a werewolf runt. Okay. So they're a werewolf runt, but it doesn't seem like they're an actual werewolf yet. Oh. So I may have spoke too soon. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there they are. The shoes are back. Are you kidding me? I took those off of you. <laughs> you know what? Have fun. You know what? Maybe just like run over here. I don't want you in the house. Okay. I just don't. I'm sorry. It's not the vibe. Okay. With your little heels. Oh, oh. Could you feed the cat? Oh, you can't click on the cow plant. Okay. Could you be a doll? <laughs> and this has gone spoiled. Oh my God. We have like no food in the house. This is so concerning. Oh, Renesmee is like about to collapse. Oh my God. Of course, you got to take care of the cow plant first because you know, priorities. But could you just make us some more food, please, Amethyst? That would be helpful. Hello. Who is this? Why are you texting me weird memes? I'll eat your sofa i to be fair that's that's the true story child how did you get down here oh my god um okay sure don't know how that happened you're a bit far away from your bed i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna lie <gasps> romantic satisfaction ends between Faye and caleb yeah again that does make sense he is kind of in our garden when we're trying to burn him to death so yeah <gasps> Jacob's now learned to transform at will. Oh, thank the Lord. I could not have handled that again. Okay. Oh, but they're, they're wide awake now. So, I mean, that's always good. But there's not really... I don't know what you want to do, really. <laughs> I guess you could carry on working out. That'd be kind of... That'd be good. But yeah, like, on here, you can change the game. So, I feel like that'd be really cute for the kids to play. Maybe we'll put, like, puzzles on there or something so people can, like, start doing it. Death is inevitable. Faye knows it. Okay. Wait, what are you eating? <gasps> You're eating the puffer fish. Golly. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> Um, I've decided actually I'm gonna put the puff fish in the bin. That's really bad and concerning that she even went to do that I did not think she'd be able to do that autonomously to be honest That's why I left it in her inventory because I thought she wouldn't eat from it But apparently she can so she could die uh, pretty easily actually so not the vibe Oh, and you made a nice meal. Thank you for the fish and chips amethyst appreciate it. Look at the bed <gasps> 300 simoleons Jacob, when did you even do that? Oh my god. Oh, this is just a lot Jacob This is just a lot to work with to deal with so the question is oh, slabby she level lost oh god this is not good. it's not going well but the question is is he gonna burn does he burn i'm gonna google it oh apparently kayla can't die in the sun oh my god <laughs> maybe he'll die of thirst though also apparently they can have garlic overload we just feed him garlic and hope that works right <laughs> i don't know guys i'm at a loss i'm at a loss right now can you craft a chat box still not a cha chat box you idiot chat box bot oh my god level five for jacob so they've only got half the way to go which is okay i'm not gonna go to school with them today because i'm gonna figure out way to kill these sims if it's the last thing i do actually i'm gonna google i don't know if they can die i'm thinking maybe we'll just go with the sauna have we got the money for the sauna actually i don't know how much the sauna costs but it seems like that might be an option yeah 2100 okay well just about enough money <laughs> but if we just delete this and also delete the pool because you know what the sauna is a classic anyways like it's gonna be easier to kill sims that way you just have to trap them in there and boom they're dead so i mean do we have room in the house <laughs> Not really. Not really. It's a bit bigger than I expected. I need Faye's room. No, I think we need to build like a basement, but I don't know if we've got enough money for that. But I've been thinking about doing that for ages anyways. Okay, we can do that. I don't know why there's just a bit of grass floating there. Bit of a bit of a vine. But if we do that, we could put a little ladder over here potentially. Be like, oh, what's behind the door? Yes, a way to kill people. So, <laughs> funny story. We do that often actually. And I'm pretty sure a sauna should fit. Yes. Oh, wonderful. This is way easier. What we do, bring them down down here. I mean, I won't do this every time. You know, we'll mix it up. But right now, I really do want to kill someone and it's really taken its toll on me. So I've just figured this is the only way. We could give them a light, you know, maybe like, oh, we could give them like a little chandelier. Just make it a steak, please. Oh, gorgeous. Gorgeous. Even give them some nice wallpaper. You know, I'm not a monster. I may be killing someone right now, but I'm not, I'm no monster at the end of the day. And I figure we just bring them down here and then technically they should die. We'll also bring Vladdy Daddy as well. I think Vlad actually does burn in the sun. Does he burn? Is he going to burn? I think he does. But you know, burn in the sun, burn in the sauna sounds the same so again i think vlad's just gonna oh what's that what's that a swarm of bees is descending on eve <gasps> actually oh my god <laughs> i shouldn't laugh i shouldn't laugh that's quite traumatic isn't it that is quite traumatic okay it seems vlad's down here in a towel but is anyone else gonna join anybody gonna join anybody gonna join although has daddy went to left no he's just deciding just to go i just don't i think he doesn't want to stay i mean again fair enough but i oh, want caleb's left shouldn't the kids be at school by now okay apparently these two are going into school today fine by me to be honest oh Vlad, yeah clement's gone is caleb on his way yes okay now as i said i think vlad will just teleport out unfortunately 
But at the very least, hopefully Caleb will die. Okay, no, Amethyst. <gasps> and Wolfgang and Jacob's relationship has fizzled away. This is so confusing to me. I don't know why it fizzles away so quickly. Lock the door for everyone. Theoretically, Caleb should die. Vlad probably won't, but that's fine. Now, let's get back to focusing on the more important matters. Although... Is it really? You know, I don't know. I'm gonna get the kids to make some friends. And maybe whilst, you know, these two are off school today, maybe we should invite over Wolfgang and stuff because I don't know why their relationship's gone down so much, but it's actually so annoying. I'm actually just gonna start a club gathering. The only thing is, is Tinker obviously can't come, but the rest of them should be able to join. Okay, Piers Vlad's going home. Caleb's still there. Oh, we oh God, we need to pay our bills. I forgot about that. Wolfgang's here. As you can see, new outfits. I think he's very cute. I want them to, I, I don't know. I mean, I, I like Edward as well, but I don't know. I'm all very confused. I can't decide who I want to and who what's just happening and okay it appears blood actually can't leave because he's trapped there but they're not actually using the sauna which is a bit annoying jake has pulled a muscle so they are having a rough time but you know what it's fine just just keep talking maybe we'll do the little puzzle thing or not because they're too tense okay <gasps> and wolfgang's hitting the bear <gasps> wolfgang that's evil that is evil that is a new low wolfgang i knew you were a bit of a weird guy but that is a new low tinker invite over nova i mean sure nova's already here even by over chloe as well yes <gasps> exam results below average for tinker oh okay i think tinker a smart in, in not school ways maybe <laughs> let's do like a fantasy guardian in the forest puzzle oh my god eve's wearing that outfit oh babes didn't you just make a friend as well how <laughs> i'm sorry to say this but how did you manage to make a friend wearing that i mean it's in it's a choice it is a cho it is a choice it's definitely something oh vlad's teleported upstairs okay at least caleb's still downstairs though that's fine that's definitely an alien definitely an alien oh the child's had a blowout great 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 tinker oh my god fear of someone controlling her life <laughs> Yeah, that is happening. Unfortunately, hate to tell you this, that is indeed happening right now. Let's promise to skip prom together with that person because I don't think Tinker will like to go to prom. I love that Vladdy Daddy is in here dancing. That's so funny. <laughs> okay, they've promised to ditch prom together, but that is incredible. <gasps> she peed herself. Oh my God, Amethyst, I'm so sorry. I did not see that. Oh, there, there's a pee. Oh, babes, please get that away. Oh my God, that's going to seep into those floorboards as well. You're never going to get that out. But I'm pretty sure there's some spellcasters here, so it would be great if you could could yeah like magic duel and stuff or not lich let's try that I feel like if it's not gonna work out with wolfgang we should invite over edward because i don't know i mean it's just clear it's clearly not working which is a shame because i really love wolfgang and like i really was enjoying their relationship but it's just i don't know like every time i press anything it's just not working and now he's feeling flighty to this guy as well like i mean i don't mind you know i feel like these two are happy to be non-monogamous but still okay still i would still like them to have some sort of relationship i feel so bad for amethyst girl try and like ugh, i don't know <laughs> i don't know what to say romance level three for jacob which is good oh it's going really well now okay maybe it was just like a fluke you know but, i mean they are like in a relationship right i'm pretty sure so it would be nice for them to to properly date maybe we need to like i don't know do promise rings or some crap like that because their relationship is back now which is good in front of like everyone as well although they're kind of away from people i feel like tinker's kind of like yo guys get a room seriously <gasps> these two are gonna go for a jewel <gasps> they are and i'm not talking about the vape kind uh <laughs> okay oh and the aliens play with the cow plant <gasps> okay oh my god how's it going babes come on i believe in you i believe in you have this you could do it get that knowledge get that knowledge get that good get that knowledge like you should come on you could do it <gasps> she got it desperio okay that's a bit sad that's making people sad but that's okay oh that's really good i'm happy i do think that alexa and tinker might get on well just because like you know one's an alien you know very obviously one's obviously very a robot you know i feel like they could get on well you know i'm just saying so i'd be happy if those two potentially have a little chat i feel like they could be besties oh flirty vlog okay how i got laddy daddy nude in my pool <laughs> genuinely happened true story that is honestly quite cool in chat totally can wolfgang please help penny pee please thank you <laughs> you wouldn't mind wolfgang really you're leaving oh to be fair can't blame the guy wow tinker level two of the robotic skill well done <laughs> okay <gasps> bro just ate the cow plant's cake oh my god that's so funny i was waiting i was like something's gonna happen right yeah it did can we milk it that's hilarious <laughs> Bro just like was really nice and then just ate the cow plan cake. Incredible. Essence of happiness though. At least he was happy as it was happening. That's always a good thing. I mean, it certainly would have been an experience. Okay, you're gonna have to just leave the child there, babes. It's not happening. Let's upload the video and go to bed. Okay, is everyone asleep? Asleep, 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 asleep. Okay, good, good, good. And how is Caleb doing? Oh, he's not looking good. He's not. I really want him to die. 
guys. <laughs> it's just been so many episodes now. No one's been dying. It's been a real shame. You know what I need to do, actually? If I just put start gathering and I put one of the likes, surely relax in sauna is one, right? I guess do spa activities is what it is. For some reason, I thought it was a specific sauna one, but I guess not. But hopefully that'll mean that he'll want to sit and do the, the sauna thing. Oh my god, Vlad. <laughs> Um, okay, that's definitely a sauna activity. <laughs> that's so funny. Oh my god. Incredible behavior, babes. Incredible behavior. Bro is relaxed right now. He's made our bath disgusting, but to be fair, I did tell him to do spa activities, and that is one. Why do I feel really bad for Caleb right now? Like, the fact that he's just down here by himself, dying. It was so much better in the pool, you know? I don't know why, but it just felt so much better. I refuse to end the episode with my Sims being this distraught. I just can't start. I, when I start the next episode, I get so overwhelmed. I'm just like, I have to end the episode now with my Sims actually being decently okay. Otherwise, I just can't handle it. Again, with the fun, like, I don't know how being a witch is not fun to you, babes. Like, that's very bizarre to me. I feel like this is very fun activities, but sure. Is Vlad's... Yeah, he's still in there. Can't use that one then, I guess. <laughs> oh, God, you're a stinker, aren't you? Jesus. Although, you've only got to get up a couple more things. Like, literally just potty and movement. So, I kind of don't want to bother until... <laughs> it sounds bad, but, like, there's no point bothering until you've gotten that up, you know? Because then you're a child. You don't have to have someone to help off you. Vlad's just got right back in there, you know? Sorry. Tinker, you're gonna have to help your younger brother Tinker. Tink. <laughs> tink, tink, Tinker, get it. Uh, Tinkle, I guess. Uh, <laughs> how is Caleb not dead yet? Dunno, he's just checking his phone. He's like, this is a bit, a bit sad, isn't it? It's a bit sad. Do you think Bella's called? No, no, she hasn't. No, unfortunately not. Oh, it's Saturday. I was getting them all ready for school. Oh, my bad. That's unfortunate for me, actually. Well, now he's using the sauna. I mean, if you're gonna die, you might as well, you know, be, be, be relaxed, I guess. <laughs> That's, you know, no ventilation here. So I think he'll die very quickly. But, anyways, guys, I'm gonna leave this video here because I hope, hopefully, this was enjoyable. I feel like not much happened. I feel like every other episode there's like a lot of stuff happening the last episode so much happened like everyone aged up and then we were at the beach and everything but unfortunately not much happened today just because everything kept going wrong i can't believe we couldn't kill caleb or any of the sims i feel like next episode caleb's gonna die just because we've got the sauna and also he's gonna starve to death so that will at least happen in the next episode you know yay um but <laughs> other than that let me know if you guys got any ideas for killing off clement we might have to just do it with cheats if we really can't kill him i think in the next episode a few things will happen so i think renesme and probably the clowns will be aging up into the older stage Ages. In fact, how much has Renesme actually got on her milestones? Also, you've got no leg. Cool, cool. Oh, she's already got seven. Okay, so she'll definitely be aging up into the toddler next episode, which is wonderful because we won't have any infants for a while then. Thank God. Um, we will also be working more probably on Amethyst and getting her spells because I think she'll probably be moving out maybe next episode, which is really sad, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. But yeah, sorry I keep filming this series. I promise I will make other videos, but just right now, it's just all I'm wanting to film and it's just so warm. I just the thought of having to film anything else was just like nah. I just wanted to do this. So yeah, hope you guys don't mind too much. Let me know what you guys think of the house as well in the comments down below. Remember to like and subscribe to everyone, and I'll see you guys in another video. I love you guys. Goodbye. Oh my god, I need some food so badly.